Up next, the journey drama continues. And, you know, I really cannot think of another band that is this huge that operates with such an extreme level of dysfunction, putting almost everyone else to shame. Doesn't matter who it is. No matter what, you can almost always count on Journey to top it. And here they are. Journey has come to bless us yet again with a new part of the never-ending saga. Longtime vocalist Arnel Pineda, who, by the way, is now coming up on almost 20 years of being in the band. I think he joined in 07, so uh, what is it, 17 years or so he's been in the band, which is just absolutely crazy how quickly time flies. Anyways, he shared a rather interesting post on his Facebook page uh, alongside a video that I guess has been going around of the band's recent performance at Rock and Rio in Brazil, uh, where I guess he's receiving some criticism over his performance. I'll, pay, I'll play a uh, quick clip of the video, and then we'll go over Arnell's somewhat strange uh, statement about it. Once again, thank you so much, everyone who came to Journey shows since February this year. I appreciate you all so much. And not only that, every time that I'm on stage with the band, I feel this immense gratitude, humility, and honor. I am very aware of this, referring to the video. No one more than me in this world feels so devastated about this. It's really amazing how 1,000 right things you have done will be forgotten just because of this. And of all the places, it's in Rock and Rio. Mentally and emotionally, I've suffered already, and I'm still suffering, but I'll be okay. So here's the deal here now. I am offering you a chance now, especially those who's hated me and never liked me from the very beginning to simply text go or stay right here and if go reaches 1 million i'm stepping out for good are you game folks let's start god bless all of you and thank you once again to all of the fans and friends who believed in me since day one look you know it's always very very easy to goof on someone when they have a, a poor performance I i'm certainly uh, guilty of it as i'm sure many of you are uh for dogging on vince neal but, you know, when it comes to Arnell, it's, it's a big difference. Arnell has been widely recognized over the years for his incredible voice, amazing performances, and, of course, he sounds very, very much like Steve Perry. I mean, if you close your eyes, at, you know, and listen to Arnell, maybe not the Rock and Rio performance, but, you know, others over the last almost 20 years, I mean, it, it really is insane how much Arnell sounds like Steve Perry, but... You know, th this Rock and Rio video, is this the greatest performance ever of Don't Stop Believing? No, not by a long shot, but it's really not that bad. And who knows what the circumstances there might have been. He could have been sick. He could have had some sort of personal thing going on uh, behind the scenes. Hell, maybe even band related. This is Journey after all. God only knows what, what it's like backstage before a show. I mean, holy shit, you never know. It could be anything at all. He could have just had a, a bad night performance-wise as well. You know, how many of us have uh, not felt like going to work on a certain day or, or being productive or whatever? It happens to all of us. What's more crazy to me here is this whole, if I get a million people saying, go, I'm leaving the band. You know, obviously that's not going to happen. A million people are not going to tell Arnell to go, even if there were that many people that felt that way, which there aren't, but... You know, obviously that wouldn't happen in a million years, and I, I certainly doubt that he would use Facebook to determine his future, uh, although it is journey. You never know, but, I mean, come on. If it wasn't for the band, he'd probably still be working at Home Depot or something. But, you know, I, I think it just goes to show you that clearly almost everybody in this band is off the fucking rails. It was only like a year and a half or so ago when all, there was all this drama over the rights to the journey name, uh, all the uh, credit card stuff between uh, Neil Sean and Jonathan Kane, there was, uh, which I guess has still been going on even somewhat recently. Uh, there was the trademark dispute with Steve Perry. The band just canceled their international tour dates beginning later this year. Uh, and then, you know, at that time a year and a half ago, you had Arnell out there saying that the band can fire him at any time. I mean, I, I, it really it's enough to make your head spin, and it's it's. The drama is so bad that it's 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 comical, and I'm honestly even shocked that the band are still at it. Yes, like I just mentioned, they did cancel uh, some UK and European tour dates for the fall, but you know the point that I'm trying to make. I, I don't know, but what I will say is that this is pure entertainment, and I am 1 million percent here for it. But that said, 
let your voice be heard. Go head over to Arnell's uh, Facebook page and let him know if you want him to stay in the band or if you want him to leave.